What's good, big fellas? I'm watching one of your favorite episodes of anime, whether you have seen it in the past or watching it currently. And we already know there's a lot of new animes coming out this season, such as Bleach, Chainsaw Man, My Hero, a lot. So if you guys enjoy anime reactions, consider subscribing to the channel. I'm trying to hit 40K subs by the end of the year. Hopefully we can hit that goal. Leave a like to support the anime and support the reactions, please, but support the anime. Come over to Twitch so you guys can watch everything live with me there. We watch everything uncut and alongside with Patreon and the YouTube membership so you guys can check out all the uncut content there as well. We are ahead on One Piece and Fairy Tale by about two months. Fully uncut, no filters. Go check it out. Down in the description below. Go click those links. That being said, let's get it started. I don't know what episode of anime we're watching for this intro, but it's going to be fire though. Lopes. All right, big fellas, we're back with more Blue Lock when we first initially watched this episode last week for the first time, I watched four episodes of anime that day, including, not limited to, Spy Family, Blue Lock, uh, Demon School, Unamun-kun, and My Hero. And Blue Lock was the one and only one I had no idea what it was going to be about besides soccer. And I'm not even a big fan of soccer in all regards. But man, if that wasn't the... Ever since Q episode one, that was the best first episode of a sport anime i've seen battle royale i guess you call it tight and i can't wait for more leave a like on this video big fellas please because i want to keep continuing with the show and i think this is going to be a really really fire seasonal anime the fact that he took down the the guy in the white hair is pretty funny and animation and everything too Fire. Crisp lines. Now, I didn't get to listen to the opening uh, last week because it played at the end. So, let's listen to it now. All right. I love the colors that they're throwing in with this opening. I like it. It's a little moment, a little sad. People are dead. It's soccer, motherfucker. <laughs> You always gotta wait to the drop to see if it's fire. Nah, this is good. 100%. What's interesting about this show is that it's not necessarily what they've stated so far. It's not necessarily about the teamwork. It's about you being egotistical and you being selfless or the main protagonist for, for that matter, which I like. You know, it's like, not really being like goody two shoes, you know? It's like the battle royale, fight for the death, but it's soccer. Who's going to be the best? Japan will never win with the World Cup. I guess this is going to be like a little background of why they made this uh, block. You money crumbling rodent. You came up with the idea, laid the groundwork, and put it all in the motion? I mean, motherfucker. At least she's trying. Piece of shit. She's hot, though, so. My oh, man. What? I wonder what his quirk is. Nah. Damn. Losers lock off. That's awkward as fuck. And you can't. So basically, if you get out of this, you can never play for Japan or represent Japan, right? But he has. He has. He still has to go play, though. Does that mean he still can't go play because he still has a. Uh, Regionals or whatever the fuck he's gonna go do. You telling me if Igaguri or Isagi are more talented than me? Oh, real shit showing, nah. Okay. Roughly 75% of the goals are born within the confines. I mean, that's still not representing his all-around skill as a soccer player, you know? 
There's no, I understand he's like he's under. He gets that there's fundamentals to what he's doing. This guy's not accepting anything. This guy's saying, yeah. <laughs> I'm on the side of the guy in the white hair. I'm just saying. You could have survived if you blasted at a mogul. Oh shit. Oh, okay, okay. So there's always still stuff to do. I mean, he got fucking locked in the face. He striker shoulders that responsibility and fights until the very last second. At least, he at least he's recognizing the strongest guy, right? We gotta fade. Like, I mean, we gotta fade. We gotta run the hands. Oh my god. I would be, yeah. Every right to be that upset. Why am I so pumped up? <laughs> It was written on your face. Man. That's the world, win or lose. It is pretty ridiculous, though. Let's keep it a stack. How does it feel to fight for your career for the first time? Okay. I mean, like actual stakes on the line. That's what victory feels like. Etch that into your brain. The beginning of Blue Lock. Oh shit. A little game of tag, man. You and Levin will be living together. Smelly motherfuckers. Team Z. This show, this show really knows how to get you like captivated like you know it, i like that the ost's in it too this the is pretty fucking good damn we lifting weights how can you talk about becoming the world's greatest strike looking like that nah too nice people people that are too nice fuck that that was actually my max This guy is in debt to my boy. My man is in debt because he didn't kick it at him when his fucking ankle was sprained. Oh, man. I'd be eating like that. I'm going to keep it hunted. Fade him. Dead. <laughs> what the... My man just sleeps like that for free? Like, get the fuck off me. I haven't got time to sleep. Sleep helps strengthen your body, too. Rest is the only... That literally helps you progress. When you play tag, you pass the ball to me. Yeah. That was a beautiful pass. There's a monster inside of me. What the... <laughs> He's like, look. Great show so far. We're already at the halfway point. What the? Unless? He's like, get the fuck up, bro. Stop listening to these fellas around you. And talks to me. Pass the ball to Isagi. I think you need to go see a therapist, my guy. Nothing wrong with that. 
What, what if he tells you to? What if, what if that? What if those voices or monster tells you start tell starts telling you to do some silly things? You know. That's all amazing players have monsters inside of them. Have they said that? Did they tell you that? Who's telling you this information? Twitter? <laughs> He's talking nonsense. Okay. Okay. They're self aware. He is talking nonsense. Oh, shit. Please return to your rooms and confirm the latest rankings. Oh, we get... Oh, we get upgraded rankings? Tight. He was at 299, right? Oh, cool. Hey, from 299 to 274? Nice. You really expect us to improve in this crummy environment? Idiots. <laughs> Twenty-five teams from B down to Z. Okay, I would have loved to see how that uh, tag uh, circumstance happened with the other uh, teams as well. Oh, so yeah, they're still last uh, in the grand scheme of things. These guys are you guys are the lowest ranks. And these fellows are good. Higher ranked players get gourmet food and train better buildings. Bro, they have a fucking... Uh, I, I forgot what that machine is called, but... You guys know what I'm trying to say. Alright, pretty boy, who's this? If I have to play in this country like this, I'd rather play with the college kids in Germany. Oh, shit. The national team of a weak country like this one will never be the greatest in the world. Oh, he's talking that nonsense, but he's not right. He's not wrong. He was born in the wrong country. Oh, shit. Now he's saying nonsense. Blue Lock Project. Oh my god, so many flashing lights. Are you saying it's okay to ruin the lives of 299 people just for one person's sake? And then during that fucking, uh, like, what if, okay, that one person gets out, right? Who's he teaming with? You know? Are there, is it all going to be just dependable on him to win the game? Because where's the teamwork fall into line? Well, he's, she's speaking. This guy's listening. The first selection will involve 55 of you in the building five. It's a kind of a five-team round robin. Only the top two teams will move to the top second selection of the survival match. Okay. My man's speaking words. <laughs> I guess you still have to use teamwork no matter what, right? Sagar initially started out with every player being a striker. Uh-huh. Just one more step and we'll be on par with the world's top teams. Better what you believe to the common sense until now. Shove new notions into your brains. I guess being a forward or, you know, what, whatever position they are um, can relatively be any position, you know. You just have to be good enough to replicate that. One person's play can change a team, a country, even the world. Oh. Not adults who have forgotten how to dream, but these youngsters who are still nobodies. They're willing to risk it all, I guess.
Blitz, bye. Yo, he's captivated. Oh, he wants all that. Ending, right? We're not going to watch the ending just because for time. But like I said, man, this show, this show is doing, this show is doing great work of making me giving, giving it a shit about soccer, you know? And uh, I, it's, it's really out there. It's really like, it, it knows that it's being really out there, but it's not taking itself seriously, which I appreciate. Leave a like on this video, fellas, please. I think this is going to be a great anime this season. Subscribe if you guys haven't. Come over to Twitch so you guys can watch it live. And check it out on the YouTube membership or the Patreon for all the uncut reactions there. One Piece Fairy Tale Ahead by a Lot. Go check out the early access. With that being said, we guys have a wonderful, fantastic rest of your day. Another day, another anime this year. Breath of the Mother. Peace out, y'all. Yeah.